this tutorial we will create and edit a polygon shape file. Most of the techniques are similar to what we learned in module 13. So make sure you have completed module 13 before uh, completing the exercise in this module. Go to catalog tab, right click lab 2 folder, new shape file. In this dialog, give the name My Local Buildings and select the feature type to be Polygon and edit the spatial reference. Select the spatial reference to be NAD 1983 and click OK. An empty Polygon feature type file has appeared. Add the world imagery layer to this map. Again, ignore the warning. Zoom to your area of interest. So we have zoomed to the area of interest. Now we can open the attribute table and uh, see how it is empty. We will add some polygons. This is the same area where we created the local trees file. Uh, let's add the trees file to this uh, uh, data frame and uh, change its uh, uh, symbol uh, for them to be visible. Just like in case of the point type shape file, we will add a field called name, which is text type, and let's make it 20 characters long. Now start the editor. Notice both the shape polygon and point shape files are available for editing. Uh, one way to know which file is being edited, edited is look at the pointer. In case of point, you will see a point type uh, cursor, whereas in case of polygon, you will see a crosshair cursor. Another thing to notice is uh, what kind of construction tools are available. In case of polygon type, we have these shapes that can be drawn and in case of point type, we have uh, these construction tools available. So go back to polygon type and let's draw a polygon. In order to create a polygon, you need to select the vertices of the polygon. For example, if we were dra drawing this uh, life sciences building, we'll start from one corner and click at every other corner that we can identify and see how it continues to create a polygon uh, for this building. Once all the vertices have been identified, click F2 to close. This completes the polygon and you can add the information about the, the building. For example, this is Life Sciences Building. You can also change the, the type of the uh, color of the polygons to hollow and the outline color to red so that it's uh, more uh, clearly visible and you can see the building behind the polygon. So hollow type uh, polygon symbol lets you see the image uh, behind the polygon. If you accidentally start a polygon and make a mistake, you can always right click and select delete sketch. You can also uh, use short key control plus delete to delete a sketch. Also suppose if you end up uh, creating a, a polygon which is wrong, you can go to the uh, attribute table, select the corresponding row and press delete. It will that polygon. Let's go ahead and uh, uh, also create a polygon of TBE building. 
and this is TBE B building go ahead and create a few more polygons in your area of interest so that's how you can add new polygons to a polygon shape file go to start and save don't forget to save uh, the edits and then again uh, once it is uh, saved you can stop the edits notice how the uh, all the polygons that were created are not showing you can always close the attribute table and reload it to see all the polygons so this completes uh, the, the tutorial about creating and editing a polygon shape file in next tutorial we will uh, create and edit a line or polyline uh, file